shit. What was that? So, do you make a habit of trying to get yourself eaten? What was that? I asked what it was that nearly killed me just now. Well, it's a worm, isn't it? This girl is nosy and she's bloody strong. You shouldn't get that close unless you've had the proper training or else you've got food handy. But you're a glider, aren't, uh, aren't you? So I suppose I can forgive a bit of clumsy worm handling. My name's Citra. I tell her I'm Sable. And she offers a quick compliment to my name, which almost soothes the embarrassment burning through my ears. After all, she after that she's all business. Now, what brought you here, Glider? Can I help with anything? I get the sense that if Citra were an animal herself, her fur might have bristled at my question. It triggers a memory where Jaddy told me that it can sometimes be a labor in itself to explain how one needs help. And that I ought to try to see where I can be useful before I inquire. But I think I've made enough of an introduction already. Do I need help? Citra gives it a moment's thought. You know what? Yes. Nozzy loves a Owen Glowworm as a treat. If you could find us some, we'd both appreciate it. I tell her I think I can do that, and decided better not to ask for further details. I'm sure I can find something. I say goodbye to Citra. Alright. I'm still waiting for those glowworms glider. Okay, so that's a that's a worm. Almost killed me. Oop, you mean mine, thank you. Oh, what are you doing? Sus. I hear the guard murmuring about pomegranates to himself as I approach. When he notices me, he clamps up and stands to attention. Can I help you? You said something about pomegranates? Guard seems to perk up the mention of the word. Yes, have you tried one? They sell them in Sarai, outside of town. They're unbelievable. Magical. Each seed a burst of watery coolness. He continues to espouse his clear obsession with the fruit, and I notice my own mouth salivating a little. Mm, I need to speak to Iria. Iria is a very important person. If I'm going to let a bothersome glider interrupt her day, it had better be worth my while. Offer a pomegranate. The guards seem delighted by my offer. Oh, Rohana, this is beautiful. He snatches the pomegranate greedily from my hands and indicates that I can pass now. Move along, glider. Sick. What's in here? Nothing. Nothing. Alright, let's go in here then. So if I want entry... Gonna have to have uh, pomegranates on hand. Good to know. Well, well. Oh. If Iria is surprised, happy, or displeased to see me, it's hard to tell. The guard by her side tenses up as I approach, but Iria signals to them and they relax. My presence is permitted. For now. So you got past Yanis. Was it a pomegranate? Or just good old fashioned cuts? It doesn't really matter, I suppose. Well, you're here now. Yes? How do I get myself merchant's badges? Iria seems completely disinterested in my question. I'm not even sure she heard me. I go to ask again when she lets out a big sigh. How do you think? What do merchants do? I know, second shot is deep. 
I ask you a question to get an answer because they're known. Don't answer that. You can buy them from them. From me. From me. Yes. I'd like to buy one. How much is it? Very well. A hundred? I'll take it. Oh. Yeah. Alright. Badge hobbyist unlocked. Nice. Anything else? I have some questions about the power cut. You have five minutes and then I want you gone. Any idea why someone might have taken the call? There is a deeply irritated sigh at the beginning of her speech and it comes like the hiss of a viper. Two reasons I can imagine. One, because there's something to gain from bringing the town to its knees. Now a sharp, annoyed inhale. Two, because power cores fetch a substantial price in illegal markets. Could be one of those, could be both, don't know. I could ask more questions. Any idea why someone might have taken the call? Mm, where were you? I can feel her eyes narrow on me, and imagine the drag of her tongue across her upper teeth. She dislikes me very much. I will ignore the implications of that question, friend, but I was here in the market. Ask around me if you'd like. Any of the guards will vouch for me. Any idea why someone might have taken the call? Ah, oh, I've already asked that one. Okay. Who do you think did it? It'll be some lowlife from the Sirai. Probably that climber fellow, Garay. They say he's, you know, one to speak when a job needs doing. One to speak to when a job needs doing. Though he's not exactly what I'd call discreet. Sort of like that. He wouldn't... He won't have the brains behind it, but if I were a scummy little nobody, he's the person I'd hire to get the job, the, the work done. I told you, you can find him on the bridge um, outside the town there. Yeah, nice. He's a suspect. I'm done here. Yes. Goodbye. Alright. A lot of side missions take me off track here. Never ask you. Just passing. This town is a maze. That's the sewage system. I don't think we should walk around there. Treasure. Windshine dime. The dark bottle for the colors of the windshine bike. Cool. Sick. talk to you again? Nope, not really. The windshine uh, mask is pretty tight. I like how I jingle jangle. I make a jingle jangle sound like a chime, would you believe? Trying to find that Garay. Should be around here some way. Around here some way. Oh, 
There you are, you little shit. Garay grunts hello. I have some questions about the power cup. He scratches himself and spits on the ground before giving me a shrug. Any idea why someone might have taken the call? Garay smells. It's not the worst, almost pungent smell. Not rot or bile or anything so pointedly awful. No, Garay's smell is like old dust, tinged with stale oil and ground into the fabric of old garments, or buried under fingernails. He clings to, he clings to him, and I turn away just a little as he answers me. Heard about a big sale going down in the Serai recently? Not sure what, but it calls a stir, let's just say. Whatever it is, it's long gone by now. He shrugs, and so I press him a little further, asking if he had any idea who the seller was. Far as I heard, it was some machinist with a mushroom habit. Not sure how true that is, but let's say it's come up a few times. Uh -huh. Where were you? Cafe. Cross my arms, mostly out of impatience, but it seems to work on Garay somehow. Alright, I got in a little scrap, and uh, is that what you want me to hear? Nothing to do... Nothing to do with anything and probably not your business, but sure. How to fire power and out for that. I keep my arms crossed. End of story. I got nothing else. Who do you think did it? He stares at me for a few, few seconds and I mistake it for consideration before I realize he's looking at me like I'm stupid. Don't name names. And even if I did, beats me who did this. But more power to him, I say. You get it? More power to him? Uh huh. I get it. He chuckles and waves me off. Yeah, fuck Gary. Alrighty. Those chickens be acting up. Mm, don't need anything. I'd like to get to the machinist just to fix it up. And then, um... Actually... No. Where is the machinist? I saw him before, didn't I? This way? Oh, am I wrong? Hmm. Can't get up there, can I? Too tall. And here is all swamp. Can't even crawl around there. I'd run out of steam and a. I'm sure I s I'll figure it out. It's fine. Wait, that direction there? No, that's the jail. I see a mask staring through the slit with a statue-like stillness. Stranger in the wall, show me the eyes. Oh wait a moment, unsure if I really heard something. The mask is not forthcoming. Show me the eyes. Hmm. Well, that was uh, kind of fucking creepy.
find it sort of fucking creepy. Where? Yep, this is the correct direction anyway. That's fine. Arms um, says, hello, what can I do for you, Glider? Mm, doesn't matter what order I do this. I have a delivery for you. Hamza smokes, but his expression is warm. Got you running errands, eh? Wonder why the music cut out there. Yeah, I like to keep busy. Oh, I can relate to that. If I don't keep working, eventually I'm going to have to think about some of the things knocking around in this old little, in this odd little brain of mine. Nobody needs that, least of all me. I'll drop this thing off with Sandip when it's good and ready. Anything else I can help you with? Uh, what happened? He crosses his arms and looks down, thinking on it. How is the lifeblood of everything we do as machinists? And our work exists to uplift the past and secure the future. Our supports the machines, and machines are bound to the people. I nod, listening. If you want to take power from people, then you wish to make people powerless. Duh. He looks sad at this. So I think you'll be looking for someone who cares little for the common person. Who are you? I was in the workshop sleeping. Get most of my sleep here lately, if I'm being honest. He shrugs. That being the case, though, I didn't notice anything was wrong. I asked why not. Because our machinist is why, and not one of us, no matter how different we may seem, would ever be caught dead without a backup generator. So I had a few hours good rest before I caught wise. I nod, accepting his answer. What do you think did it? If I had to say, you are the merchant. I don't tell him I'm listening, and he shuffles his feet, getting close to me, his voice lowers to a low rumble. Iria and her ilk run this town. The markets are their locus of control, and they've got their claws in the food stocks. Now imagine, if you will, what happens when the power goes down. All of a sudden, folks are stockpiling food, and Iria and her lot are hiking up the prices, and there's not a damn thing any of the rest of us can do. You should look into Iria. You'll find her weaving a web of corruption from above the beetle market across the bridge. You will have to persuade her guard to let you pass, though. I already did all this. I already did all of this already. Okay, I'll check with Hammer. Oh, this might make things a bit easier. Do I want to go into town from this way? It's fine, I'll do it from this way. Yay! Ow! Ow! Can I just go in from here? Stand if rocks from the balls of his feet to the heels and back, pleased. Good news, Hams has finished his work on the spare power core. I could use your help with it if you've got a moment. I can help. Perfect. I'd like you to take the new core to the comic card and plug it in and while you're there. See if you can't pick up any clues about who may have stolen the original, yes? What sort of clues? Well, you know, something in place. I ask how he does it as a guard. You like tapestry, yes? Have you ever looked at a big, beautiful, ornate tapestry and been so impressed with its craftsmanship? And then suddenly found your eyes drawn to a tiny little snag? Just one thing out of place? Use it like that. Blues yeah. are like that. Hamps left a keycard for you. You'll need it to unlock the front door. The central chamber is protected by a security code, but I'm sure you'll find your way in. The thief managed somehow. To get to the Atomic Heart, head over to the substation just outside town and follow the power cable that runs through and understands. See you soon, hopefully with news. Alright, and let's go talk to this, um, area again. 
Is there a way to do this without climbing all over the walls? Maybe, maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. Brum, brum. Oh, can I talk to you? Yes, I can. Any cuts to spare? Anything will be appreciated, Glider. I'll give you 50. Because I'm generous. Sorry. No, I'm good. He gave you 50 and there was nothing. That's... That's not good. You know! <laughs> Wait. What's Duffer, this? Come on. Yo, welcome in. I reckon that's um something from uh Suffer, how are you? You are a better gamer than I, and I know this for a fact. <laughs> Mr. Suffer really must have uh, raided someone. Welcome in everybody, my name's Crash. What up? How you all doing? Yo, what's going on, Neff? How are you? Cyber Truck Alpha, thank you for the follow. Hi man, Sora, love to meet you. Suffer. Mate, thank you so much. There you go. Alright. Chaz has been going for 47 minutes. We'll probably cut off about 8, eight or so. Okay. We're good now. We're good now. That was a bit weird. <laughs> Um. God, look at oh, so many things. So many things. Can I maneuver my bike out of here? Or how about this way? Is this close to where I need to be? <laughs> Probably not. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Was it something. No. <laughs> right, you got that area. You know what? It's fine. I'll put my bike near the front. Like that. And then I'll... I'll go back to where your area is. It's fine. Why is that chicken chasing me? Doctor looks concerned and frustrated. This power cut, all of our medical equipment, prost uh, prosthetic alignment, artificial wombs. Artificial wombs, wow. It's all going to run out of power very soon if the energy doesn't come back. Those useless guards and machinists. Hmm, artificial wombs. Cool. through here? There's something through here that I haven't seen. Gimme! Hmm. Spotted. Kinda cool. Um, we just want to climb up on the roofs. Might be easier if I do that, yeah. Oh, gimme! Ch 
chum egg. Hmm. Nesto, okay. So we need to find um, the place with like the scarab, I think it was. Statue. Is that it? It indeed is. It was you. God damn it. Is it because of the... So... I mean, if I had to guess, look, it, it honestly does make sense that Iria um, has, like, the motive to do it. Garay seems too incompetent. He could have something to do with it. Hamza felt like he was a bit aloof with his answers. He had some good alibis, but he just, like, something's not right. Why was his place trashed? Anyway. Follow the giant cable. Okay, we'll do this then. I thought I could get um, her to mess up or something, but I guess not. Guess not. Hmm. Getting harassed by chickens. Where's my... Can I swim? I can swim! Not Canadian. Oh! I see a chum egg. There's probably another one up there, probably. Give me the chum egg. Can't go any faster. Like a moth to the flame. I need the Chum Lee egg. Chum Lee. see oh that's why i've got my thing over here okay let me spy who followed me thank you for the follow peace to hippies i appreciate it we are just playing video games on twitch 
And I'm about to get a chum egg. Love getting me some chum Lee eggs. Chum Lee. Yeah. I think I I've got about half an hour left in me. Specifically I wanna finish off this mission and then I think that'd be a good place to put the kibosh on this. But again, thanks for the follow. Uh let me just Can I can I game, please? I'm going to give you a cheer. Or I was going to. <laughs> Here we go. Ah, oh, that's um, it's, uh, the Korean cheers. Yes, yeah, in, in Hangul. There we go. Anyway, back to it. So yes, why is my chat paused? There we go. Okay, I got my Chumley egg, now I need to find the other uh, cable. Right there, okay. Wait, was there something here? Oh, just weird looking, okay. Oh, can I get you? Can I get that dragonfly? Yes, I can. Oasis dragonfly. Hmm. Can I get another? Yep, you. Get me up. Thank you. something around here. I saw it flying. You all saw it. Oh. Did it somehow get over there? Jesus. Oh, found you. Oh, the way. Oh, did the, is it like, just like Skyrim, they fly away after a while. Oh no, I see them. Oh, they're, they're birds, birds, humming, 